Hello. Not rude. I was living a good life. I had a future going for me. I had a job that I loved. I had friends that cared. And a mother that supported me in everything. But it was all gone in an instant. He took everything and left me with nothing. Except with one question. Why God? Miha, let go of your phone already. For what? It's my phone for a reason. We're here in church. Okay, and what about that? That has nothing to do with me. Yes, there is. You're going to meet someone here that's going to help you. Who am I going to meet? Nobody talks to me here. That's why you have to go out there. You have to speak to someone. Why do I have to go out there? That's what they're supposed to do. They don't even want me here. All I do when I get here is take a picture. That's it. Who knows? Maybe just a picture is going to help you more. They're, you're probably going to be reading the Bible and it's going to help you more as well. How's a picture going to help me? I already have those on Instagram. Those are fake likes. These are real. How are they real likes? They don't even like me here. Look, I'm just going to leave you here, okay? For what? No, I don't want to stay yeah, here. You're going to stay here and then I'm, I'm going to pick you up later, okay? It's my decision. I'm not going to stay and here. In this moment, I didn't even know if God was real or not, and I also didn't know how to pray, but I would just look around and see what everybody else was doing, just to blend in. How was church yesterday? Um, it was alright. I didn't really do much. It was boring. Did you learn anything? I learned that they stand a lot and close their eyes a lot. Any new friends? No. I told you, they don't talk to me. They're weird. You have to promise me something. Oh my god. You have to look at me when I'm talking to you. Uh-huh, I'm looking at you. You have to be in God's presence even when I'm not here. Okay. When I leave, when I'm not here in this world, you have to stay in His presence. Oh my gosh, there you go again with the, I'm not gonna be here talk, like, I know. I'm being sincerely honest with you. You have to follow his footsteps when I'm not here. Oh my gosh. You know I'm not listening to you, right? Like I really don't care. Deep down inside you're listening. No, deep down inside I'm hungry. Mom? 
party. What are you doing with her? Bro, can we something, bro? Dude, take it all. I have nothing. Please. She's all like that. Take it. Take it. ask myself every day why god who says he loves us and cares for us would take my mom away from me and leave me feeling abandoned but the more i spoke to him and the more i read his word i was able to understand god's reason my mom will always be one of my greatest examples in life 
I always felt an emptiness inside of me as if something was missing. I tried different things in hopes that I would somehow feel alive, but nothing worked. For years, I heard so many stories of people coming to church and saying that Jesus saved them, but I didn't understand what that meant. Until now. All God wants from us is to love Him above everything, and He'll take care of us. Now I found my reason for living. I feel joy, love, and peace within myself. I thank God every day for the great testimony I can share with others. He heals all of our wounds and fills up our emptiness with His Spirit. Today I understand why God.